welcome back to Everything Castle. I hope you're all having an amazing day. Thank you for all the love and support you've been showing me. Today I'm back with another review of a Burberry banner bag in medium. Uh, it's more a review of what I think of the bag because I've been using it for six months now uh, and also most importantly for me when I buy a bag what fits into the bag that's extremely important for me here we go Ta -da! look it's a gorgeous bag with um, studs, golden studs all throughout and it's got the brand name here uh, and the studs go to the side and on the side we have the classic Burberry checks. It's got a long handle, it's not extremely long, it's got a long handle, it'll probably stay up until your waist and it's also got a short handle which you can carry like this. At the bottom you can see there's five big studs which uh, so if you put them on the floor it doesn't really touch the floor. It's got a bit of a thingy over here. The best part about this bag is it is almost that scratch resistant it doesn't scratch at all look at that but some of the um, leather bags uh, I have it scratches in, in, in a second like in a flash of a second I move my hand and I'm like oh my god there's a scratch but this one is extremely good I took this back to India for um, almost two months and it came back with no damages that's a big deal like branded or not branded whenever I take it for holidays it always, especially to India, it comes back with some of the other damage. This um, did not damage itself, so I'm extremely happy with the quality of the bag, the durability. It's very well made. It's um, it's a very good bag for work or even for like a regular day out. But the only negative of the bag for me um, is the fact that it's very heavy like there's nothing in the bag at the moment but it's extremely heavy so and because the bag is very spacious for someone like me I will I tend to um, fill the bag with a lot of stuff especially if I have a big bag I tend to put a lot of stuff in I will show you in a second what fits into the bag um, so because the bag is very heavy once you put stuff inside like it's extremely uncomfortable especially if you're using this um, handle here. Um, so what I do when it's heavy is I just carry it like this, like a, like a suitcase or something. That's the only negative about this. So I'll show you the inside of the bag. So it's got a big compartment here and two small pockets over here. And you can close this with the magnetic buttons. And this is middle compartment with a zip. And there's another big compartment here and a pocket compartment over here right and this one can be closed with the magnetic button as well and to keep the shape of the bag they've got a belt over here you can take it off if you want to make it bigger but I would never do it because it's going to spoil the shape over here and they've also got this little belt over here to keep these two handles together going to show you what fits into the bag as I said that's extremely important for me to see how big or small the bag is all right so let's start with my makeup pouch so this is my makeup pouch and look at the size of the bag against the makeup pouch so the makeup pouch goes in um, I'm just putting in random things to give you an idea so I'm putting in a perfume bottle this is a Bottega Veneta I don't know if there's no okay but I got Veneta, I love this perfume. And your phone, of course. And a notebook, I always show you a notebook because um, I like to carry small notebooks in my bag. So, you know, if you're someone who likes to show um, carry notebooks, then uh, not. This is one of my favorite uh, Bulgari books because it's got all the Bulgari collections in here and also all the vintage actresses um, pictures with Bulgari jewelry in here, look at that, how beautiful is that? I love books like these. So yeah, a Bulgari um, book, uh, what else can you fit in? Your wallet, of course, you need your wallet in the bag. This one, this has a story to tell as well. Everything I take out will have some or the other story to it because I'm a very emotional person and I'm, I tend to attach sentiments to a lot of things. So um, this one is my first Burberry ever gifted to me by one of my best friends from school, um, Ramya. 
she gifted this Burberry to me. It's a coin wallet. Um, it's it's probably eight or nine years old, but it's still as good as new because I've not used it much because um, especially someone very close to me gives me a gift. I want to keep it like fresh and new for as long as I can. So yeah, this is one of them. So it's got, oh my God, a lot of stuff in now and it is extremely heavy. Oh my God, I can't, like walking around with something like this the whole day, no way. So if you want to walk around the whole day, this bag is not for you. But otherwise, um, it looks Fabulous. Uh, there's, there's no describing this bag. This comes in a lot of colors. It, um, it had pink, it, um, the store had pink, maroon, and black. But I chose this one because um, I don't know, I don't have a brown color bag and I love the golden studs on it. The maroon and the black and all the other colors did not have the golden studs. So I chose this black and I'm, I'm I mean, this bag and I'm very happy with it. And next one is my. Um, two of my favorite Burberry scarves. Um, I did not buy them all at once, bought them separately. This one is a wool and silk mix in the classic Burberry design. And this one's 100% silk, as you can see, in different shades of pink. So I will start with my favorite classic one. Who doesn't like this design? Like everyone loves this classic Burberry design this it's extremely long i can't even fit into the frame it's very very long um very light material so you can use it in any any weather um it's not definitely not for extreme cold um it's you can you can style it anyhow you can you can just just put it just around your neck just like that with the jeans and shirt or jeans and top and boots it's classic like denim white t-shirt and brown boots with this scarf it's classic and you can also drape it around like that anyhow there's no rules with the scarf you can just play it around however you want it still looks stunning stunning is the only word this is there you go oh my god i just love it like in any form of fashion this is one definitely has to be one of my most favorite burberry scarves Next one is the pure silk Burberry scarf in different shades of pink and a pale grey and black. It's a very um, small scarf, it's a very dressy scarf, definitely not to keep you warm. I haven't seen much uh, of this one, so I'm, I believe it's a very, um, you know, one-off piece. Put it on with any dull outfit and in instantly lifts the mood. Um, the silk definitely gives it a very... Um, you know, evening um, party sort of a feel.